official that it's clock. <gasps> it's a button. Is there anything significant about your you have a clock, right? Oh, there's things on the side of it. Yeah. It has like, um, I guess, kind of dial-looking things with like yeah. numbers on them. Can you control them at all? No. Nah. But I can tell you how many are on each one. Yeah, start with the bottom one. The three, yeah? Yeah, and then there's a little circle on the bottom bottom, but we'll start with the bottom one. It has um, three. Yeah, which way is it, boy? They all three point. That's the top, center, and one either side. Is there anything, like, is one lit up, or...? Of the dials. Yeah, of the little, yeah. Um, no, it doesn't seem to. Are you able to line them up? I think that was wrong. Can you make the clock do anything? Nah. I've got a book inside my clock. Yeah, I've got a book inside as well. Nah. Oh, shit. What? Do you have, like, a, a painting that's made of tiles on a wall with, like, flowers on it? Yeah, I have a couple of them. Can you move the flowers? I can hear you moving them. But no, I cannot. I have a couple of different ones that you might have to make. Okay, so the one with the... You know how there's pieces of... Have you got... Oh, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> with the four squares, what's in the middle of them? Um, so I've got... It's a flower that consists of... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 petals. So eight are a light pink. Okay, just wait. Are is, that the, is that the one in the center of each square or in the center of the whole painting? In the center of the, each tile. Pink one. So each tile has got like one complete flower. <sighs> Okay. And then there's corners of flowers the whole way around. Okay, so the top two, the top two tiles have the, um, you see how there's the piece of flower that has, the centre of it has lines with a circle on the end of it coming out of the middle of the flower? Lines with a circle on the end of it. In one of the corners. One of the little pe flowers. Okay, so what's in the corners around the pink flower? So each corner is like a different, like a, is a quarter of a different style of flower. Yep, I need to know the style of flowers. Ah, shit. So I've got one that's got really long petals. Yep. Um, and it has like dark red V, lighter red V, dark red V, lighter red V. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, and diagonally from that, there's like a flower which has little lines with circles on them coming out of the middle of the flower on the diagonal. Circles. Yeah. Little circles. Either way, just put the the top two tiles. Put the V flower in the middle, middle. So like yep. diagonal. Yeah, they should be touching each other in the middle, and then on the bottom two tiles, put them on the outside corners, the bottom corners. Oh, so it shouldn't be, like, symmetrical? No. So the top two is the same and the bottom two are the same sort of thing? This this one, yep. Okie dokie. There's more to do. Did you get it? I don't know what it's meant to do.
your clock, how fast is it, is it swinging? Tick, 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 tick. That fast. Tick, 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 tick. That fast? Yours might be faster than mine. Well, I can modify the speed. Tick, 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 tick. Yeah, tick. pretty on par. Alright, the cuckoo. What sound does the cuckoo make? It makes a cuckoo sound, but it's a little jester. So, cuckoo. I've got like. Cuckoo? Yeah. Um, one that's got like a, a, a note in it as well. A piano note? No. Nah, it just goes cuckoo. One's just like a whistle, and then one's more. No, nope, it's generic right. cuckoo. Do you need to know what time right. the clock says? No, I don't think that means shit in this actually. Okay. All right. What sound is the the um the tick of the clock? Yep. Literally a tick. Well. I just did that? something. Well, you, you stuff that up. Whatever you did. Yep. Fuck. I think you're onto it with the painting. Did you make it the same as I said? I think the painting's right, but I think there's something, there's definitely something in that clock. So, I've got four different kinds of tick noises that can make. Yeah. I can't. One. Sorry? I'm trying to think of how I can describe each one. This one is a generic clock tick. They're all pretty almost generic. This one kind of goes net. Oh, huh. <laughs> I've got like a deep one. No. One wouldn't... that's all not very generic sounding. It's more like, um, like flicking the top of your pen. I don't think that's it. There's a higher pitch one. Yeah. More like uh, 60 minutes, I'd say. Yeah. I think and then there's another deeper sort of one. I think maybe the 60 minute one. Okay, I think I've got the speed right. I think it's just this last bit. Tick, 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 tick. tick. What do you, can you change with the cuckoo, the sound? Ah, oh, there we go. Where did that open? Okay. Alright, this too. Now we have to figure out these paintings. What? Well, I think I've only got one painting that I can actually move. As in, to change the tiles on. Or did you do the one how I said? Ooh, I, I think so. But hang on, I'm just gonna search around and make sure there's not another one or another thing. I've got all my paintings that I can take and move around the room. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Describe the flower in the center of each square. In the center of each square. So there's a small flower. It's got five petals, and then there's a bigger flower with one, two, three, four, five, six. Is it circled eight. by a whole bunch of other little flowers in the center? Yep. Okay, sweet. The middle all matches up with the light green um, 
bird's eye view of a Waratah. Sorry, the Waratah is red, but the leaves around it are bright green that look like they have water droplets on it. Like the droplets here. Yeah, they're all in the center of the whole painting. Uh, that's that one. Hey, there should be one more then. You should have one more. Painting to do. Yep. Well, yeah, there's that one downstairs that we're playing with. Is that. Oh, the... actually, no, there's another one. Yeah, yeah, there's another one. Alright. So, this one's got. Um, They're like. The of They're a little flower with perfect circle of leaves around it. Yep, 100%. Okay, so the bottom two tiles have the big long finger like petals in the middle. Oh god, I can hear you moving it, and it freaked me out. Um, and then the top two tiles have the fingers in the outside corners. Top corners. Something, uh, something just made, made a noise. Oh, one of the paintings opened up, and there's a book inside. Oh yeah, there is too. Oh, uh, do you have a purple thing? Purple orby thing? Yeah. That should have opened up as well. Yeah, I already did that one. I don't exactly know the clues to it, because it's here, and it shows like the light on the purple orb, and then you touch to it has an arrow to an unlit up orb, and then you touch that, and then it does something. But I just run around and touched them until they all lit up. That was a sound you kept getting. <laughs> okay, so we should only have two books left. Yeah. One is all the paintings I need to move around with all the birds. But I don't know how they work. So you can collect them and replace them? Correct. Ah, okay. What one have you got above the fireplace? Above the fireplace is... It's a white bird with a, sna a blue sa snail shell. Yeah. It's got like a weird spindly crown thing on it. And one beak? Yeah, just a yellowy orange beak with yellowy orange legs. Okay, well that's the same as what I had. Any other ones you can figure the marks out of? Maybe up the wall beside the two you changed? Well, do we... Oh, yeah, up on the wall. Oh, uh, start at the bottom of the steps. Yeah, so that is like kangaroo head with a snail hat. And it's got like its tail is biting itself off, and it's got white bird wings. Yep. And then the next one is the one you could change. Then the next one up is is white with double beak, like yep, with fireplace. snail on the back. Next one. Yep. So up the top near one of the other movable paintings, like the flower painting thing. Oh wait, what is there another one at the top of the steps? Well, I've got two, like one at the bottom of the steps, one at the top of the steps, and then I've got one, like up on the landing at the top. Okay, give me that one. So that's got camel head, lion head, and then beak biting itself. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Do you have any more positioned anywhere? Then I've got one on an easel. Yeah. What is it? Um. Snail or white wing. It's a kangaroo with white wings biting its tail off with no snail hat. Yep, and one more. And then I've got one just sitting on the floor. And it's camel, lion, horn, snail? Yep. They're all correct then. Huh. Take your um, painting off that has a graffiti on it. Oh, can you remove that, can you? Yeah. I can't remove mine. Oh. What books do you have? Do you have A, E, S, P? Yeah. Maybe I've done one of the paintings wrong? Above the fireplace you have shell bird with one beak, white crane yep. shell. Yep. Sorry, let me just... My ears. Oh, no. My friggin' 
thing is hurting my ears. What did you just do? Nothing. Oh. Then on the floor beside the easel is camel with horns, lion, and shellback. Yep. Easel is kangaroo with white wing tail biting itself off. Yep. Bottom of the steps is kangaroo white wing tail biting itself shell hat. Yep. Then the next one. Then after that, where's your um, graffitied painting? It's down near my door. Like that I came in on. Hmm. Can you remove that one, can you? Yeah. Oh. oh, so maybe it's in the wrong spot. Yeah, I think I figured it out. Did it. Okay. I had to move that down, and one of the ones I had on... Yeah, I've got it. And... Now we just gotta get. What's the other puzzle we have? Is there something you haven't figured out yet? I'm like walking over desks trying to see if there's something that I have to click on. <laughs> gotta be something we haven't done. I have a door I can't open. Yeah, I've got like a, a door that's all destroyed. Uh, yeah, and it's been this yeah wired up. Trying to figure out where our last book could come from. There's, there's still those clues on the side of the clock. Do they help for anything? No, the we unlocked the clock. Oh, I bet you those clues were like, it's the. Did you have four cuckoo sounds? Uh, three. <laughs> Okay, because it's got like four, five, and then three down the bottom. Uh, yeah, three down the bottom. Uh, the, the bottom one's cuckoo. Anyway. It has to be something we haven't done. Oh, wait, I've got candles. Do you have like a candelabra with all candles on it? Like seven candles? I've got a three one. I've got a... One, two, three, four, six, seven, yeah. What's lit up on the seven? So going from the left, yeah. first two, then yeah. two off, then one on, then yeah. one off, then the last one off. There you go. Oh, there's a book there. Did you spell your word now? It's whatever was graffiti. Uh, uh, I, A, S, then I have N, E, P. What do I do with these books? <laughs> they should be, beside the fireplace, there should be like a, a section, a section for them on the bookcase where you can... You got it! Yep, 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 yep. NEP. Is it Ian's nap? Yours? Espion. Has anything happened? No. E S P I A N. Maybe I need to spell yours? Yeah, that's probably what it is. Okay. What was yours again? N E P. Yep, IAS. Yep. Okay, and mine's Espian, so E S P I A N. E S P I A N.
the door opens. What door? What door opened? In the middle of my bookcase opened. That's what I thought would have opened. Oh, there it is. Took its time. I need one more shard. I oh, know. Sold everything. This, uh, I think there's the jester guy playing the... Are you... I mean, some room with like... The flame things and stuff. Oh, there's a song going on mine. The jester's singing. This guy's literally singing. Oh, he stopped singing and he literally just disappeared. That was kind of... what that noise was. Oh, sorry, that was me with the rest of my sound ones. Okay, well... It was just like... <laughs> but it was nothing. Okay. What the hell do I do? I've got, like, things about different plants that seem to be alive. Carrots and... Root vegetables and flower things. It's like you put certain ones together to make things. Um, I don't think mine tells me that. It just tells me each oh, one. On Alio Mig Migna Oxyluroborata. Great, whatever. Well, I'm just. And then I have another book about mushrooms. And then a book about hermit crabs. Sorry, a poster. And then I ha have a chalkboard with different letters. It starts at the crystal at the top, and then it goes to different things. Sorry, I was talking to mum for a sec. Sorry, I was saying yeah. what else I had around. So I have that same book, like O H O L O T P A. Oh, sweet. Is there a pathway between some of them? Or did, what's the order? O H O L O T P A D L O T O H O L O T. Yep. Uh, P A. Yep. Uh, D L. S D L. Yep. P O. Yep. Uh, F B. Yeah. Uh, F J. Uh, P J. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, F A. Yeah. P L. Yeah. P B. Yeah. O X. Yeah. P E. Yeah. F R. Yeah. And P T. Okay. I don't have P T on this one. It has been. Oh, there's like one missing below it. Same. I've got the missing one, and I I don't have PT. 
I see you're missing one, like missing PT and one. And then I've got a smudged out one. I've also got a crystal at the top. Mine goes like a branching graph, I can't think of what it's called, where like it starts at one thing and it branches to three, then they branch to two. Almost like a family tree, but instead of going upwards, it goes downwards. Yeah, I have that in the middle of my book. Oh, so you can arrange them? You can arrange them. I didn't know if you could arrange them, that's all. I can't move. I can't do anything. Okay, and your book doesn't say anything about... Because I can click them and circle them, that's the only thing. I've got like all these... I've got different potions. That you can use? Yeah, I think I can just put into a thing. No, that's all I got. The posters and that one thing. Oh, and my books, sorry. The posters and books. Oh, excuse me. and I can put them into machines and make them into stuff. Yeah. Like uh, make them into other potions. Hmm. I'm not sure what to do with that. Just give me a second. Is there any, do you have any other books? Only on like the plant and the kind of living plant things, then the living vegetables, then the hermit crab poster, then another one about so, mushrooms. I've got a hermit crab. Just give me two seconds. I've got a little red toadstool mushroom. Sweet. Sorry. Okay. Okay, yep, yeah, hermit crab. What does it look like? It's like a green hermit crab with what? like a shell. green colored shell. I need what shape? Standard is shape. That doesn't like help. Okay, like it's like wrinkly and like almost in like a pyramid horrible pyramid shape. Saggy, it's like a saggy dude. Lots of wrinkles. Yeah. Okay. Um, that's a para paraxio file or file x ray. Don't know if that helps in any way. Did you say you have a mud? Xio file x that's a PJ. Okay, sweet. PJ, yep. What was the yeah, does it. yeah? What mushroom did you have? Explain it. It's got like a red top. No, I have no colors. Sorry, I should have said that. It's just like a black like, and white sketch. So it's like pretty pointy. And um, it, it's just one single like mushroom. Like, yep. 
And it has like little. Oh, wait, they all have roots coming off. And the like little plates underneath it, almost. I think that's it. And it's just one top. There's no layers to it or anything. No, it's, it's just got a couple of little wrinkle lines in it, but that's about it. Yeah, but it's just smooth top bar those wrinkles. It hasn't got stuff on it. Yep. Oh, I didn't know what that's called. That's a fung hero ba hero fung hero borate. is an FB. I was going to say, but it's just FB. Okay, do you have a, like, living carrot or root vegetable or potato with all eyes? Or turnip, maybe? Beetroot. I did, I did, I did. I made it before. Um, it was a combination of these two. No? Wrong? <laughs> I need that, and then a living, another living plant, which is usually looks like seeds or a flower. Here you go. Yeah, like it's like a carrot with arms. One and single flying. carrot. Yep. And he looks like he has an overbite or underbite. Yeah, it looks sort of cranky. Yeah, and he has three leaves coming out of the top of his head. Yep. Yeah. So, oh, wait, that is a. Uh, Oxymurex Oxymurexoris Something like that Like it ends with X-I-O-S on the end? X-I-S on the end? No, R-I-S, sorry Oxymurexoris O-X Yeah, so X-O-R-I-S is the end O-X Yep Yep um, So, what, you've got one more plant thing do you? Yeah. So what's it look like? Uh, it, there can be like two dandelions that are like Siamese twins. It could be a little weed, kind of angry with like stuff coming out the head or a bunch of like fruits dangling together. A bunch of... I've got um, a dandelion. One single dandelion? Yeah, it's got like a little face on it. Why did I see that? I thought I saw a single dandelion. This one's like, is that like a dandelion? Like it's got like a shut top, like its head goes up like it's shut, but then it has petals coming out the top of it. Yeah, it's got like a round head and then it's got like hair coming out. Yeah, that's a, like a delpha. Yeah, it's got like two arms that go up a little bit. It's an, yeah. Um, Delphilo, Delphilogic, okay. Just Kate. Kate on the end. Yeah. He's a DL. 